Okay, my epoxy is now pretty much dry. So that switches down. Okay, so next it's start uh, time to start wiring things up. Um, so you have to uh, look at your altimeter and see where the switch wires are going to go and the battery terminals. Uh, the battery terminals are on this one are right here. So I can go ahead and stick those in. Okay, now these, my switch is right here, um, a little long, so I'm going to go ahead and cut these. And go ahead and strip the ends. There's one. There's two. Okay. Um, now we're going to have to run wires to these terminals. And one of them is going to be um, direct mounted which means it's never going to come out and so it's basically it's going to come out of the hole here and then attach here and then this end is going to go to the altimeter so I'm going to be about that long and then I need to strip both ends this until a little bit later. So this is to the main. So this is going to be the front. So the front is always going to stay attached. So um, on the on the rear one, I'm going to make a notation. on this end. Okay, there's one. I gotta get smart on this second one. <laughs> Actually, I need one more on here. This uh, nut right here is going to be, um, that's going to set the position of the altimeter. This one here will go through. See how this one works right here? It will stop it 
and we can adjust the position back or forth. And then this was going through here. Like that. And this will be attached to these terminal blocks. System. Okay, and you can pull the slack through. All right, just like that. And then this, yeah, it's a little long. We'll take care of that later. I can always cut those down. Okay, and then the front end. Again, we're going to put another screw on here. We're going to put it on the opposite side. And that one is going to be to set the position back or forth. We're not going to go ahead and do that yet. And then this one's going to go on here. So on this one, so we need a we need a short wire from there to there. This is the one we're going to remove after each flight to reset everything. Um, so I'm going to put a note on here remove this end okay. and this is going to be the bottom oh I got it backwards <laughs> I need to switch my sled around remember my battery should go forward so this should be the bottom my wires are not quite long enough. Okay, so now my battery will be facing forward properly. Uh, 